Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm SilentRunner54 <coughs> and we are into Chapter 6 of the Star Wars Phantom Menace 25 celebration event. So we're at the point of the film where the pod race is about to take place. So you can see the races are all on the grid ready to start. But there's a mission that takes place just before the race and there you can see Darth Maul is stood on the cliff top and he's watching Qui-Gon and Padme so this is the pod race arena the Mos Espa arena and just having a look around, so we'll head in. And what's this guy selling? Oh, we don't want any of that. So I don't remember a lot about this level, so I'm having to... Um, ...have a bit of a wander around, just to see if I can figure out... ...how to trigger the next... ...event. There you go. Get here. Would you like some fresh dried chokey? Oh, yeah, we need to speak to this person because we need to find out. Oh, we need to ask how to make fresh dried chogi. Uh, do you sell anything else? Ask about a thermal detonator. And I think we use a Jedi mind trick. So she's not convinced that Qui-Gon's a farmer, so we'll use, yeah, we'll use the Jedi mind trick. Which hasn't gone down very well. Okay. Um, so no thermal detonator. There's a I have quite a few Republic credits. You can have them all. Republic credits are speak to this guy that's trying to get money off me. You don't need my money. Yep, Jerry my trick. I don't need your money. I'm sorry I have bothered you. Have a nice, have a nice day. That's that situation diffused. Yeah, she's not going to talk to me again. So no thermal detonator. Um, I remember you need the detonator for a bit that's coming up later on. Um, with um, a, a beast that you fight when you go see Jabba the Hutt. Yeah, you've got nothing I want. Um, let's go speak to this Twi'lek because she was one of the ones that was hanging around outside Wato's shop on the last level. So yeah, we'll just get her to take us to Jabba the Hutt. Oh, don't be in such a hurry. The race doesn't start for a few minutes. Because we need to convince Jabba to lend us money to bet on Anakin. So we'll just follow her. 
to Jabba's, um, I suppose it's kind of a throne room. Going in through here. Down into this red area. And Chapa should be through. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, well, he is through here. We've got to fight this monster first, this beast. What do you want? After we've told him what we want. Don't bother using Jedi Mind Trick because they don't work on Jabba. To just listen, basically just choose all the options to get through the conversation. To those of you watching who aren't familiar with um, the film, none of this takes place in the film. We get to the arena, Qui-Gon never goes to Jabba to borrow money. So obviously they eked out the story a little bit, they exaggerated the story um, to basically make up some levels for the game as they do with many many adaptations but yeah this none of this takes place in the film this is purely for the game but you know I thought I'd put it in just to flesh it out so the beast is dead normally you can use a thermal detonator but again I use the lightsaber and I've got invincibility on just for the purposes of the story really um, So now we go not this way. So this is Jabba's stand, Jabba's throne at the races. But we can't talk to Jabba. At the minute, we have to go through his interpreter, so it doesn't give us many options other than we can just tell him that we're back in Anakin. We think Anakin is going to win. Jabba doesn't share our optimism. But we have the pegots from the beast pit anyway. I wish him 
So now we'll speak to Team Tor when it will when it triggers the conversation. Or we'll speak to Watto's um, helper friend first. We need to speak to Watto to be able to make the bet. So now we have to go get him a drink from the bar after oh we'll speak to Team Tor first now it's let us talk to him. And Jenna Man tricks do work on drunk people. So we asked Team Tor to take us to Watto, but he's not going to take us to Watto, he's going to take us to the guy we just spoke to. So now what we need to do is to get him a drink. It's more likely to talk to us if we've got a drink. Give him a drink, even. There we go, I'll go get Majori juice. And then we've got to get one for his friend as well. So yeah, we've got to get him his friend a jar of juice. So back to the bar. Speak to the droid and get another jar of juice. And no. Once we give the guy the drink, we should be able to come and see Watto. So, yeah, he tells us that Watto's not interested, but there's Watto on the balcony. So we speak to Watto. You had suggested that we wager on the outcome of the pod race. You are persistent. Give me 50 gold faggots and we can bet on the rest. If your race wins, I'll give you a T for T. But if Anakin Skywalker wins the race, he will grant the boy his freedom and give me the T-14. If he loses, he keep one of the fastest pod racers ever built. In either case, he can have my money. Anakin! But the boy has never even finished the race! So we're about to close the deal. We've made the bet. Watto takes the Pegots. What do you got in the mind? Nevertheless, the 
left. If the boy wins, you shall set him free. It's a deal. Fifty pegats and your fundraiser for a depot in hyperdrive. So now all we need to do is go find Anakin. You better hope he wins. He'll be waiting on the grid in his pod racer. I accept your offer. Here is the money. It's a good bet for me. Especially since your pod racer doesn't seem to be working anyway. Isn't that the smoke coming out of your Padres armor? So we'll go round and back to the bar area. And when I find it, there's a door that takes us to the um, the seats, basically, for the arena. Here we go. And we just jump down. We run across to Anakin, and you'll see there's a little lizard that does a runner with um, a part for Anakin's pod racer. So the story's not over yet. The adventure, the, the mission isn't over yet, so now we've got to find... It's this way he's gone, I remember now. I'm going to chase him up um, the staircase in a minute. Down here first and we're going to get attacked by sun people. So we're chasing background and up these set of stairs, which is the way we went to head to Jabba's palace. But we go the other way into a little hut. Now he says he doesn't have any, any have anything, but I always kill him anyway. Let's push this box that reveal or pull. No push, definitely push. Push the box and it reveals a secret area. Grab a little health pack. And there's another little health pack over there. And then the next room is a big... Dude with a gun. <clears throat> and if we attack him with the lightsaber up close, a shield activates. And it just knocks us back, so we can't touch him. And it actually drains your health as well. Um, the best bet is to just deflect his fire. Or if you have a gun, if you have a blaster, equip the blaster and shoot him. But I find just deflecting his own fire back at him works best. There's also two automatic turrets in the floor. Once you've killed him, you grab the ignition capacitor and head back out. Round back to An give it back to Anakin, who's now sat in his pod racer. Hand it over to Anakin. And then once he takes the part, uh, it will set off the the final cutscene, which is where the pod race takes place, but only from the arena's perspective. So it will just be the commentary, what's happening on track, and then Anakin coming through to win. Um, and the next chapter actually is the Boon to Eve pod race. So Hopefully you've liked this video, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more Star Wars gaming and as the Padres sequence 
players out. Just a little conversation between Watto and his friend. And as Anakin crosses the line to win the race, I will see you for the next chapter, the Boonta Eve pod race.